Ailey and I want to say thanks so much to our patrons. We really appreciate your support in helping make Elder Dragon hijinks a thing that will continue for as long as we can play casual Ridiculous Commander. Thanks again, patrons. Hello and welcome to your weekly dose of shenanigans. It's Elder Dragon Hijinx. Hello, hi, I'm Ailey. I'm Olivia. I genuinely thought for a second you forgot the name of our show. <laughs> <laughs> I Where may have. With, this? With, with how tired I have been, I may have forgotten it, but no, I'm okay. Holy <laughs> hijinx, hijinx. I made it easy for myself. E D H. Can't get it wrong. <laughs> We will get right to it because we've got one heck of a long game today. We've got two great friends. We have Alan from Mental Misplay and Joey from EDH Rec joining us tonight. So we can't wait for y'all to see this one. What's up, guys? Ramp Gang, Mental Misplay, the Slurms McKenzie of EDH. I'm here to have a good time. Keep the party going. You can catch me basically anywhere you can write Mental Misplay. You could get a plane and skywrite it and I'll show up in the sun like the weird baby, right? So we've got... Uh, Gix, Yawgmoth Praetor today. This thing is designed to do one thing, and it's draw me cards. I want to start out with low-cost evasive flyers and punch people, draw myself cards, and kind of politic to encourage everybody else to draw cards. And it uh, then ends with, like, a bang, using his ability to play lots of spells from somebody else's deck. It's a total blast. Hey, I'm Joey from EDH Rec and the EDH Rec cast. You can find our podcast every Friday, and we've got bonus videos on many Wednesdays, like our Upping the Average series, a whole bunch of stuff that gives more context to the data on EDH Rec. And I'm here to play more classic reanimator goodness. I'm playing a new Vohar deck, which is here to discard amazing, wonderful, huge, enormous creatures, don't worry about it, into my graveyard, and then I'll just reanimate a whole bunch of them and hopefully bash face. Today I am playing a brand new build for myself, Liberator Urza's Battle Thopter. This is my first colorless deck and I hope it doesn't suck. I even get to play things at instant speed, so we'll, we'll see what happens. Today I'm playing a Christmas present from EK Plays Cards. You know those super awesome little promo videos you see on Twitter for the show? Yeah, that guy. He sent me Halana and Elena roommates. So I'm gonna be playing with the roommates. They like to put counters on things. So I'm just basically gonna get a whole bunch of big dumb idiots, put counters on them, and then send them in people's faces. He knows me so well. <laughs> I have a request for every Wait. time you cast the battle thopter. Uh-oh. You have to go. Thop, 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 thop. Get ready. <laughs> Round one. I feel bad about this opener, and I shouldn't keep it in all honesty, but... Are you kidding? It'd be red. No, I know, but it's a one land hand. Oh. It's everything else I want it to be. <laughs> it's fine, there'll be land in there somewhere. YOLO. I might not do anything for a few turns, but I'll, I won't miss land drops. <laughs> That's okay. I, I got an awesome opener, though. The, my turn one play is going to be an all-star. Is it going to summon Steve Sunu, though? Probably you not. You said it's an all-star. Mm. Oh, nice. He's all about that smash mouth. I respect his dedication endlessly. <laughs> <laughs> all right, friends. Shall we roll a mother fluffin' D20? Let's roll a mother fluffin' D20. Yeah. Oh, I rolled a 18. 13. 17, wow. Oh, Joey. oh highs. What'd you get, Joey? I got a six. Well, I'm, I'm going to not see. I feel bad opening with this. Like, I don't... <laughs> You know, Let's see you it. know what? We all said it's fine. I know. Ooh. So go on, do your degenerate things. Okay. I will I'm drop excited. us to the thopter. I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna play a waste. I'm gonna play a, a lotus petal. Uh huh. I'm gonna play a jeweled lotus. Hey. <laughs> I am going to play battle thopter. <laughs> hey, you gotta do the thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. There you go. The helicopter. You can't stop the top. You can't stop the top. <laughs> <laughs> oh, too no, good. No pass. Okay. <laughs> I know he has flash, but you guys shut up. I have to play this right now. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty good. I've it got was all right. To see. It I'm was all right. right yeah, you are, buddy. You got him. You, you did the thing. Card. I'll yeah. keep it on top. That's all I've got. I'll go ahead and pass. <laughs> All right. That is the. F I want everyone to know that this is the first time I've ever played a jolt. <laughs> feels good, don't it? <laughs> I they kind of hate it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. That, 
big draws. Mainly because playing something like that, I'm like, okay, well, how do you back it up? And he's like, oh, no, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Someone gets rid of it. It's like, okay, I'll just hang out for a minute. <laughs> yep. uh, we're going to do Swamp, and we're going to suspend a Mox Tantalite. Hey! Um, what now? What is that? <laughs> this is a, um, a, a, a Moxin with no mana cost, and it has uh -huh. suspend three for zero, and it makes a mana of any color. <laughs> oh! You got so that's cool. cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I like the Soul Ring one better. The Soul Talisman, I think, is like oh, the funniest yeah. thing in the world. But uh, the, t the Mox Tantalite's cool, too. It, 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 nice. it can hang. <laughs> Sick. All right. Cool. Hold that. Yep. All right. I shall draw. Now we'll play. I'll be boring and play a forest. Let's go. <laughs> Time to back it up. Yeah, yeah, let's see. Yeah, can you back it up? I'm gonna play a waste. Oh god. To follow up? I don't know if there, if there is one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? Let's make sure that there is one. I will crack the pedal and then tap two wastes for a sort of hearth and home. What does that one do again? That's pretty uh, good. This is the prot green white. It gets two two prot ah. green prot white. Whenever a equipped creature deals combat damage to player, exile a target creature you own, then search your library for a basic, put both on the battlefield, then shuffle. So you ah. blink something, you find a land, you put them both on. That's cool. Now I understand why you kept a one lander. Yeah. Two Ailey for three. Or, right. Excuse me, two. Two, 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 two. <laughs> Fine. Um, so the reason it's two and not one, and I know how to count, is sort of is a two mana. It is more than Liberator's power. Liberator will get a one one token or one one counter. I don't know what words are today. It's fine. It's okay. My yeah, brain has not functioned at all recently. I Yeah. The things I, that I did wrong yesterday, I changed my child and I was about to reclothe him without putting another diaper on him for one. And I was like, okay, that's not how that works. You're ready sure for some I almost serious put my skin hot marks. cup of coffee, yeah, into the fridge. That's another thing. Mm. So yeah, I'm I'm with you there in the brain not working department. <laughs> I dropped something six times two days ago. Like it didn't, it, it was not the same thing. Like at six separate instances, I was just like, my hand stopped working. <laughs> it was so bad. I was mortified. I was like, I can't pick up anything of consequence. It's like, I'm just going to walk around with paper just in case. Were you like, were you at home or were you like in yeah, like, a, like, like, like were you at like a housewares store? Like, no, I got like, like a full, stuff. full night of sleep. I'm just walking around. It's just like, I just like seriously old lady, like my grip would just disappear. She, and I was like, I guess I didn't need that. Accidentally transported into that everything everywhere all at once universe where they have hot dog fingers. Yes! <laughs> nice, solid. I love that. <laughs> so, I feel like I've done enough. I'll pass. Yeah, this is pretty good. See, <laughs> here I was really excited uh, to have the first commander out because mine's only two mana. But Olivia already showed me up. So, I guess I'll just play mine on turn two and it'll be like only okay. Consolation uh, prize, that's fine, done. yeah. I went, hang on, I've never read this guy. What does he do again? Oh yeah, this is Vohar. I wouldn't worry about him. Uh, oh, okay. Vohar is a merfolk looter who's also a Phyrexian. Um, ah. You can tap to draw a card, discard a card. If I discard an instant or sorcery card this way, each opponent loses a life and I gain a life. That's not going to be happening a whole lot. I want to discard okay. big creatures. And it uh -huh. can pay to, to sacrifice itself to get an instant or sorcery back from my graveyard, then recast that card. It flashbacks one of my spells. Uh, okay. I have to pay all the costs for it. It's also sorcery speed only, so it can't like flashback counter spells or anything like that. Okay. Um, but yeah, no, it's just it's an innocent little looter that'll dump like twelve it's drops in our graveyard. Just a little fish graveyard. friend. Sure, yeah, okay. Be a problem. This it's guy fine. put in work in the Dominaria pre-release. I remember getting like two of these in one of my pre-release kits and oh. being like, "Oh, let's like we're dumping spells. Like, let's go." <laughs> cool. It was a blast. So, but yeah. I like it as a reanimator package. That's actually super funny. I'm like, I'm yeah. like. Excited to see what ha what comes out of it. Yeah. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna pitch a fit. Whatever you reanimate, I'm be like, no, this is terrible. <laughs> but I'm, but I'm, fun, I'm go with excited. Fun for the whole um, family. Mm -hmm. That's the turn. That's me. All right, we're gonna tick down to two suspend counters on my Mox Tantalite. I swear to God, if you I can't wait for that one color mana, man. Woo! Your sword <laughs> proliferates, doesn't it? No, that's the other one. No. Thing. Oh, that's thank the other God. One. If you proliferate these suspend counters, I'm going to just turn the camera <laughs> off and leave them. <laughs> I've, had, I've had those days recently where it's just like, you know what? If something goes wrong and I can't do this, I'm just going to walk away because I might just cry. No, we're, good. <laughs> uh, we're just going to drop a second swap and I'll pass it from there. Sweet. I will done on tap because I did diddly squat. I will play a mountain tapping too. And ramp time. Gonna ramp and growth, search for basic land, onto the battlefield, tapped, and sure, ruffle. That's me. Okay. 
My God, I am just not being punished this game. This is disgusting. Oh, don't worry. We'll find something. <laughs> Will you? Um, I'm going to play a waste. Surprise, surprise. I know, right? Just going to spread the love around. I will tap the wastes, equip the sword. Joey, your turn. <laughs> okay, thanks. Joey gets more love. Love that for me. Yeah, me too. Uh, I will... Is it please God May? Uh, pretty sure it's a May. It's not! <laughs> Are you oh, sure? the counter, yeah. Isn't it up to one? <laughs> it's up to one. No, it it says... up to one. Oh, it does say up to one. I just saw one. I was like, my... <laughs> I will choose to exile nothing and find a land all the same. Cool. So it's not a condition, right? Nope. That you have to to get yeah. the land. Okay, that's cool. Correct. It says up to one. I can zero is included in that, and then get a basic. Put them on the back. Shuffle. Oh, I will. At what turn should we start fearing uh, massive like Ulamogs, etc.? I gotta. I gotta get there. Ah, <laughs> so I she does have them. <laughs> of course. Uh, well, I mean, what other colorless big beaters are there that aren't like the large? I mean, the large artifact creatures are in here. I only have. I can only find two of the Eldrazi. So you can't I only put in two of the Eldrazi. The void, oh. right? I thought you were void of color. No. no. Okay. No. I thought you were talking about Joey, and I was going to say we should start fearing it this turn. Uh, <laughs> I know <laughs> Joey's got plenty of potential here. These are not the droids you're looking for. Yeah, it's what's in be my a hand? Of stagnation immediately. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I will. I, oh, I will say what's in my hand isn't going to help refill my hand, and it doesn't need anything else than what I have on the board. So it's not really the hottest state for me. I just had a very explosive start and yep. top decks. Yeah. Part of the cards. Woo. Pass. All right. We untappy. We draw step. Please no steppy. Play a sunken hollow. What I need. And I'll just play a simple little Demir signet. Oh, See, I'm, just I'm baby. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll just go ahead and pass the turn from there. Awesome. We're going to tick down that Mox Tantalite. We've got one suspend counter left. I'll draw a card. Uh, in response, I'd like to proliferate. Oh. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Don't do no, that. Can... You're going to make him alter four faster than... Yeah. You can proliferate when the vaccine... You can proliferate these out. nuts. Yeah, nice. <laughs> I'll tell you, what, you can proliferate. <laughs> Very good. Uh, we're going to do a swamp and we'll tap three and out comes Gix. So things get real hairy, hairy now. Hey, Gixie. Um, Whenever a creature deals combat damage to one of my opponents, its controller may pay one life. If they do, they draw a card. I'll pass from there. So we got it's big, a gift uh, that keeps on giving. Big Edric energy out, out here right now. Uh -huh. I'll ship it. Also, uh, your swamp. Excellent choice, sir. Oh, oh I love you. those lands. They're so good. We got a big mix. This is one of the few, the sparkly ones that I oh, have. Oh, they're so, so good. I love cool. those. It's it's really annoying because obviously I like the Sam Burley art. You know, his lands are amazing. And then mm -hmm. I love the Magali ones. They're also amazing. Mm -hmm. And then I also love the planet ones. So I'm like, ah, there's too many good lands. It true. I just make sure they're all different and then I get to enjoy all of them. That's why mm -hmm. you just got to celebrate the diversity of basics and not run the same one in one deck all the time. <laughs> I mean, yep. listen, you want to be an, you want to be an art appreciator? Run it all. Yep. <laughs> mm. The one land where I tried to get a whole deck full of them was the swamp. There's an Amonkhet, uh, an Hour of Devastation swamp, where it's just like a street that's full, filled with blood. It's Ooh. like not even a swamp. It's just like a like a sidewalk. I was like, that's it's a good blood for thing. blood god. <laughs> that sounds awesome. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm just going to get Halana and Elena out. Roommates, first strike Roommate. and reach. They are two, three at the beginning of combat. Put a one one counter on another creature where this is their power, and that gains haste until end of turn. So I need some buddies. Oh my god, go they were brrr. roommates. That's my turn. Okay. <laughs> I will say the one thing that is kind of sad is there's only two arts for the wastes, so. Yeah. So I'll play a waste. And then what shall I do? My hand is so gross. I didn't say that out loud. Uh, yeah, I was just like, uh-oh. You did, though. No. Um, <laughs> I am going to sad robot. Nice. Classic. Hey, with the good art. Oh, it's so good. Great art. Oh, that, that's cool. This art that's is, cool. it cannot miss. It's just. I'm, I'm just saying if this the is one uh, of those skull clamp that... from that set ever goes missing. <laughs> no, I'll fight you. It's in Brea, which means you touched my Brea deck and took oh. something out of it. Nope. Mm -mm. I'll just touch you. <laughs> you have a skull clamp at home. I'll just catch you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no Shut. can has. I'll grab a waist. 
That was an artifact that is more than Liberator's power. Liberator gets the counter. Is it more than his power? Since he's got Yeah. Power? But isn't it at four because it's got the sword on? Oh, you're right. You okay, no, nope, we're Joey, good. It was it's four. fine, still at one. No problemo. <laughs> yeah, you hit me for four damage. I, I hit I you no with power. the sword. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. <laughs> Alan, I'm spreading the love. All right. That many. Um, we'll blink this and get a lance. I'll get double lands. So it's four? Lands. Yeah. Sick. That's so gross. You, no Gix trigger for punching me, though. Correct. Mm -mm. Mm. You got to tap that thop thop. I will shuffle. I am done. Oh, uh, well, I've got a quick thing on your end step. I'd like to no! activate Vohar. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm worried. I'd like to activate <laughs> Vohar. I'll draw a card and discard a card. I'll discard this ancient brass dragon into my I graveyard. remain worried. <laughs> no big deal. What does the brass one do again? It is the reanimate equal to <gasps> dice Reanimate number. equal to a d20. Yeah. Oh. oh it's, it's fine. I wouldn't worry about it. Now I'll move to my untap step. Uh -huh. Wherever you want to, not just your graveyard. You can get real dumb. Joey, have I told you how great your hair looks today? It is creatures, though, eh? <laughs> oh, only creatures, yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> I'll play Manamo School at Water's Edge. I <laughs> sadly <laughs> don't <laughs> have... <laughs> I won't be reanimating it this turn. Uh, so I will I will pass to Oh my god. Ooh, let's go. Untap. Mox Tantalite hits. Let's go. Hey. Big ramp. Big ramp. We got there. And, the food ramp. Card. and let's do a punchy. The players will... at home see what I've done. <laughs> Everybody's got blockers. Um, yeah. How I'm only at two three, so you could swing at me if you need two, to. Two three, sure. Yeah. We'll we'll come in at uh, at Ailey for three on the ground. Alana, I'll let it jump out the way and let you through. Nice. I will <laughs> pay one and draw one. Land for turn will be a swamp, and let's do four, and we'll play a Cryptgast. No big deal. Everybody oh, I know that guy. What does he do again? Cryptgast is... I can take off the goofy sleeve. Uh, no, oh. do not call Dama's work goofy. <laughs> Dama's... Sorry, I can take off the exquisite How? sleeve. There you go. That's um, better. It is a double swamps for me, and it also has extort. It's such a good card. I need to get me one of those, because I'm going to mono black deck. <laughs> uh, I'll ship from there. Sweet. Um, tip it, tip it, tip it. I'll draw. Ooh, hi. Oh, you're fun. If it turns a forest, let me just work this out in my brain quick. We'll be here for hours. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Takes one to uh, know one. Listen. Nice. <laughs> Did you ever get in the tank just reading your cards? <laughs> <laughs> those are the Transformers cards. Every one of those got me yeah. in the tank. Or <laughs> MDFC. Like, yeah. Tell me who hurt you. Show uh -huh. me. Ooh. Ah! That's a great Irish synergy age. with them. Yes. So, go to combat. I'm going to give... Huh? Nice. No. <laughs> no. No. You don't have any instance in those colors, hopefully. I don't know, but we'll find uh, out. Let's be real clear. Okay, it's a flash creature, which you played at sorcery speed, so... Try again. <laughs> read, read the third and fourth line of text. Oh. Oh, okay. I didn't read the rest of that card. Yeah. <laughs> Anywho. It's the awesome. same thing we're running into. Just yeah. card words, they just all <laughs> become blurry. This, <laughs> this one here, Teflon, yeah. slides right <laughs> off. <laughs> uh, I will pay five. Then. Oh, reading the card explains the card. I got to have wrinkle space sure available and I am out. <laughs> what should we do? Let's do this one first. Herd Baloth. Yes, Ooh. whenever one or more 1-1 one -one counters are put on this Baloth, I may make a 4-4 four -four beastie. Good card is good. Good card, good card is, is good. good. I'm having fun. This is wow. great. I feel powerful. Okay. I could have hit something, but uh, no, not really. Nah, I'm just going to keep my commander back here. You're just putting counters on things, you two. All right. All good. So many things to untap. What's that face? Got, am I actually okay at deck building? <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm going to pay four for Mystic Forge. So I'll just... Oh, that's a good card. Look and cast the top of my deck as I see fit. What is that face, ma'am? <laughs> what the face what yeah. was that ma'am sandwich over there? <laughs> this deck card. is um, <laughs> it's having an excellent debut. I'll give you that. That's pretty good. <laughs> Playing the good cards. Yeah. 
Oh lord. I will just use my bonus hand here. Yeah. And uh, play a mimic vat. Oh lord. <laughs> cool. Let's see what else uh, the deck has in store for me. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> okay. Oh god. Oh. What else did you find? I can't cast that, so don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing with my life? Ayla, you've got reach, though? I do. Yeah. How Lord just said it's reacher? Only a 2 3. I'm not jumping the way of a thopter. That's wise. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I'll just... you've got protection from green anyway because of your sword. I do. Yeah. That's yeah. a good point. <sighs> Sorry, Ailey. I, just... I, so, I know. I see the red border. I'm like, all right, disregard. <laughs> the punches. Red. Danger. Danger. I'm danger. Punchy. I have been spreading the love. I have been adhering to that tenet. So I am going to swing at you for four, Ailey. Sure. I will blink simulacrum and get two lands. Oh my God. So it's putting in a whole bunch of work for you. Holy oh, crap. Oh, crap. Yeah. And here I was thinking like, I don't know if I should put a different sword in. This one, mm, 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 mm. no, it's this a lot is of work. okay. This, this is okay. <laughs> All right. Good so thing I'm one. in mono black, the known artifact removal color. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, I should have somewhere in here, I think. Listen, I'm running things that are not artifacts as well, because there's so many colorless cards. I will shuffle, and then I will use Mystic Forge to just look at the top of my deck, but I won't cast anything, so I will pass a Latorn. If, if we're on your end step, are we? What? Tap the top tip. Yeah. Uh, if we we're are. on your end step, I would Joey, love to tap Vohar. Have a little chill. To draw a card and Tiniest discard chill. this ancient stone idol, this 12 drop creature, don't worry about it. The what does that one do? Uh, it's it's kind of, it's neat. It's a 12 12 with trample. And when it dies, it makes a six 12 with trample. I, it's it, it's kind of cool, but oh, that's not my only trick. Uh, okay. I was actually kind of hoping that Olivia might attack me because oh. I have, as it turns out, an instant speed reanimation spell called makeshift mannequin. And I would like to but revive an ancient brass dragon. Return target creature from a graveyard to play with a mannequin counter on it. As long as that creature has a mannequin counter on it, it has when this creature becomes the target of a spell or ability, sacrifice it. So if you so much as look at it, it dies, <laughs> but it's here. Okay, so you have a big bad dragon. I have a big bad dragon. And then you can roll dice and bring back, okay. Yeah, and now I'll untap. Oh. Hey, Alan, turn. you wanna be friends? Ooh, these are good cards. <laughs> I'll tap uh, Vohar again to draw a card and discard a card. That's also a good card. I'll discard this Overseer of the Damned. Overseer of the Damned is a demon. When it enters, it destroys a creature and makes zombies when my opponent's creatures die. Olivia, I am in the punchy, punchy moods. I would like to go to combat. Would you? And I, I would like to send my untrump brass dragon that I got last turn over in the air at you, please. I don't think dragons have to ask for permission. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe forgiveness, but never permission. Yeah. <laughs> I want to do the reanimating thingies. You're <laughs> sending... Uh, seven in the air. Joey, I will unfortunately take the seven damage. Oh, no, that sounds great. That's not unfortunate at all. It's very unfortunate. No, it's awesome. So you <laughs> and take then, and seven. And then, and then, and then, and then. And then, and then, I... No, and then. I, since I've dealt damage to someone with my ancient breast dragon... You get to pay life and draw a card if you want to. Oh, right, Holy Gix. Gix trigger, let's go. Yeah, yeah. thank trigger. you, that sounds I'm remembering triggers this time, usually it's Joey. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, did I forget the Gix trigger? When you hit me, yes. Do you want a card? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, I do. I do want the card. Then you'll so pay a life for it. I will pay a life, I apologize. <laughs> I, a life, draw a card for the I Gix. didn't get the Gix noise, so I forgot it. Ancient Breast Dragon, roll a d20 and hope that I get a big number to revive some of the creatures that are oh, in the graveyard. Oh, I'm things. vibing so hard that you get a one. Yeah, 100. Uh, four? Oh, four? I'll take nice. the four. I rolled a four. Go. That's fine. Okay. I don't get anything fun. <laughs> fine. No, I no guess. small no small boys in, in anybody's graveyards? No. Not no. I no boys in my graveyard. No small mm. boys. Just rampant oh, growth. Yeah. Little guy. I guess I'll oh. just have to cast this cauldron's gift instead. What's that? Uh, Cauldron's Gift. Uh, if at least three black mana was spent to cast it, I mill four cards, and then I may choose a creature card in my graveyard and return it to the battlefield with a plus one counter. Oh, on. that oh no, card. thank you. <sighs> so, Olivia, I, I could get back this Overseer of the Damned and destroy the air terror thopter. You do what you think <laughs> you have to. I'll put it that or way. Or I could get back the big 12 trample thing 
and we'll be good. We'll just Joey, you should you should you should live your life. I'm gonna get the, the ancient stone idol. That's that's the one that uh, I'm feeling right now. Did you mill the that. cards? Did you pay three black? Could you no, get some? I did play held? three black. Sorry, I got all up in the politics that I forgot about the game. Uh I will mill for <laughs> I will mill for it. That's an astral dragon. Astral dragon's great. You already picked, sorry. Yeah, no, I do kind of want the big thing. <laughs> I want the big the thing. Chonky boy, huh? Yeah, and it gets a plus right. counter on it. So it's actually a 13 with trample. Ooh, that's spooky. That's yeah. fine. All right, I'm all done after that. Mimic all that right. quick. That's when something dies, right? Yes. That's the only time you can steal it. Yes. Okay. It still does get a death and go to the graveyard trigger, or is it a replacement? Uh, mimic that reads, when a non-token creature dies, I may exile that card. Nice. Right, yeah. It's really yeah. wild in Conrad, because Conrad sees the thing die, then it sees it leave mm. the graveyard for Mimic Vat, and if a lot so of things good. die in multiple times in a row, then you can have each of them individually oh, leave. Like, I love Conrad. He's so bonkers. Yeah. So boy. Big draws. Land for turn is going to be Swamp, and we're going to do four and we'll extort a vexing puzzle box. Hey, that was my preview card. This mm -hmm. is one of my absolute favorite cards because it gives you your own little mini game to play throughout the yeah. game. And if if you'd like to proliferate the puzzle box once it gets counters on it, we're all set for that. I think I'm in trouble. There's like a lot of punchy boys out here. I'm gonna play something like semi block-ish maybe. We're gonna do another extort and we're gonna do seven for an extorted and more Dama art with the actual Dama. Uh, we've got an extorted Harvester of Souls. That is a uh, death touch. So we'll maybe stave off a little bit of the punchies. Uh, whenever another non-token creature dies, I may draw a card. I forget what that puzzle box does again. What does that one do again? Puzzle box is whenever <laughs> whenever you roll <laughs> one or more dice, put a number of charge counters on vexing puzzle box equal to the result, tap it to add one mana of any color, and then roll a d20. And then I can remove a hundred charge counters from it uh, and search my <laughs> library for an artifact and put it onto the battlefield and then shuffle. I've never gone over 50 charge counters. So yes. uh, you're not really, trying hard we're enough. We're really hoping yeah. to get there. I'm, I'm like every day, I'm like one step closer to building the dedicated Vexing Puzzle Box deck. Um, but you we're going to roll make that a your commander. I'll just, I'll just. Rule zero. It's, yeah. It rolled across the mat, but we rolled an 11. I'll take it. Sure. And <laughs> no open attacks, unfortunately. Don't like that, because we probably want to see Solemn die. I'm not swinging into a 12 12. And what oh, is 13 13? Oh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's the uh, the power and toughness on the board over there? I've got a 4 4 and a 2 3. No, those are too big. All right, I'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> this is too big. <laughs> working with small numbers here. <laughs> <laughs> Untap. Draw. More green things. The forest. Then, shall we do dumb stuff? When don't we? I think... He, yeah, I think I'm going to do this. One, two, three, four, five. For Olivia's favorite card, one of Defiler of Vigor. He, hey -oh. I hey -oh. am going to fly to Canada and beat you up right now. Okay. <laughs> I'll I love have a spare that room ready no, no, for you. Make sure you never leave. Exactly. See? Yeah. You know, we'll start like an international incident. No, we won't. I'm not going to say anything <laughs> that would send me back. <laughs> no, I'm going to kidnap you and then the Merkel will try to save you. And you'll be like, no, I don't want to be saved. <laughs> kidnap. <laughs> yeah. Well, oh, end up right. paying taxes and at least they pay for health insurance. That would be <laughs> wild. <laughs> yeah, this is a 6 6 for 5 mana, because why not? It's fine. so good. It's yes. such a absurd card. It yeah. really is. Instead so of green, creepy. I can pay two life, which is nice. And whenever I cost a green friend, uh, I can put a one on counter on each creature I control. That seems like a good idea. Like Let's a lot of do creatures. that. That is a so lot of creatures. Crazy. Okay, it really so. is absurd. I might need more dice for this. Uh, <laughs> I will pay. I'll pay two life and one mana for. A little wildwood scourge. Oh! Yes. So before this enters, everything else gets a counter on it. Squad gets big. You got buff boys over there now. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And then the Bela that is so excited. When Things he gets are on happening. It. I'm glad I have a big dice bag. Oh my god. <laughs> so big. So you have a 1 1 counter on you. Cool. You make a 4 4. I do make a 4 4. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't hit me with it. 
Please. <laughs> beast. <laughs> okay. People keep complaining I don't ever draw beasts or things, so I will draw things now. <laughs> that, that looks like a slug, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> right, so that guy doesn't get a counter because that happened afterwards. So this is whenever one or more. Okay, so it's not for everyone. Thank goodness. Oh, you go up to three now. But I can't cast the other thing in my hand, which makes me sad. Or can I? I can. I can. I will pay another two life and two mana for Kadama of the West Tree. Oh, mm. oh, baby. This seems fun. Everything gets a counter. I make another friend that everyone, including you. Well, that's dumb. And then this one gets another one because whenever one or more counters, I put a counter on that one. Okay, so he's going to grow nice and big and chunky. Does Wildwood Scourge trigger for every non-Hydra creature you control? I think so. Whenever one, yeah, whenever one or more counters are put on a non-Hydra creature, put a one on counter on this. Okay, so that's just seen everything. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Another four, four enters. This guy's gonna have some big fancy ears and googly eyes and a derpy <laughs> smile. <laughs> beep, beep, with some claws beep. down there. Sweet. No one said they had to be pretty beasts. No. And then this hits the board. Kadama of the West Tree. Modified creatures, which are countered friends, mm -hmm. have trample. Whenever a modified creature you control deals combat damage to a player, so should I for a basic land card, put it onto the battlefield, tap, then shuffle. Okay. That sounds oh. fun. I would then like to move to combat. Alana and Alana are going to put four counters on Bird Bailoth. Yes, that makes sense. Then I get another one of you, friends. And another counter on the Wildwood Scourge. Yes. I was all proud of my, oh, I've got a 13-13 trample over here. And you just put like 40 power on the board in a single turn. Mm, yep. <laughs> About to end games out here. <laughs> so he's large and can attack. This was the only one that was here from last time. These are all new. So this is a 10-10 with trample. He's got the highest low of total. Alan. Yep. No, but then I don't get a card off of you. Yeah, Gig strikes again. If you really think one <laughs> card is the deterrent here, it makes, it makes all the difference. Yeah, but you got, it's got Death Touch too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> but that oh, keeps Gix drawing the cards. Touch? It's okay. just no, no, no. no the, the... Uh, Harvester. Harvester has Death uh, Touch. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, that needs to go. Take 10 or kill a thing. Yeah, we're just going to eat 10. Wow. Sick. Chalk. Okay. I'm going to find a basic land card, put on the battlefield tapped, and then shuffle. That's my go. I have one card in hand. <laughs> All right, I'll untap. I will play a mana crypt. That's a good card. Yeah. Ailey, are you sprucing up your beast tokens? <laughs> yes. I want <laughs> nice. them to look spiffy. That's amazing. It does kind of look like one of the Dr. Seuss. It's a Grinch kind of. Yeah, yeah, it's like a little Something. Grinch baby. Yeah, yeah. Big Whoville vibes for sure. Hell yeah. I will tap seven. I will play Chromatic Orrery. That's a big one. That's a big one. Yeah. Oh, so, we're supposed to all go, oh, when that lands, right? <laughs> Why? <laughs> a, a commercial. Oh, no. oh there's okay. A, there's the commercial cause, of that. Because when Post Malone plays it, everybody loses yeah, their Yeah, everyone freaks minds. out. It's like, why? <laughs> what is that? Oh, I don't even, I have literally no idea what you're talking about. So, okay, I got you. One, two, three, four, five. Oops. Six. And play Coveted Jewel. Oh, dang. One, two. This stuff's getting. It's Are getting you squishy. addicted to artifacts? Do you need help? You got a board <laughs> when the fun there stops. Now. I will play a <laughs> land for turn. So I have five, eight. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I will tap three to play a sculpting steel and have it come in as the orrery. No. <laughs> oh. Okay. I oh, don't. It's the orrery. <laughs> Where are the white players? Where are the board wipes? <laughs> I'm the white player. It's me. <laughs> now, I was four just putting it work. With a colorless commander, you can tap five mana and pay zero life with chromatic orrery to draw a card. Is that correct? Have, you, have we broken chromatic orrery? Five tap draw a card for each color. Ooh, yeah. Let's get oh, real good. Oh, wait. It's draw oh, no, a card for around. each color among you. Oh, so it's tap five to draw it's, zero cards. Draw nothing, zero yeah. cards. Yeah. <laughs> absolutely. Tap five, do nothing. Exactly. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I call a mana sink. Uh, <laughs> and not the good kind. So I'm still at what? One, two, five, 
10 mana to play around with. This is fun. <laughs> I thought I was doing all right in the mana department. Nope. Well, I'm doing better. I mm -hmm. will question what I'm doing with my life. I'm going to add three mana of any color. It doesn't matter what it is. I'm going to play Sofi. Oh, dang. Ooh, now it's, what? It's uh, Sword of Fire and Ice. Oh. Pro blue, red. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, two dar two, two target to any damage creature. <laughs> 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 and, and I draw a card. <laughs> Too dark it. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't stream tonight. Um. <laughs> oh me, oh my. What is on top now? Oh, okay. Uh, 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 let's see. <laughs> Just, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. So uh, much mana. Myself. I don't know what to do. I, it's not oh, even that it's so much what? mana. It's just like, what is even the right thing at this point? Okay, this is not useful. <laughs> oh, so that's, just gonna, I, listen, just I plan on it. Um, oh my lord, what have I done? So these two are soulbound. <laughs> <laughs> Why is there no colorless seedborn muse? Um, it's an unwinding clock. I Wizards know, of the I Coast, it, on it, the it, off it, chance that you happen to be watching this, don't no. make colorless seedborn. It already, it already exists. There's well, no, not them. colorless. Unwinding clocks only artifacts in the way aren't artifacts. I want these. Oh, mm -hmm. you're trying not to have the lands too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that actually, that's not does? true. It's it's Feast and Famine. So you have a seedborn muse. It's just a couple extra steps. Yep. Ailey, you're scary. <laughs> I'm you. In fairness, I am also scary in mm. a different kind of way, in an unhinged kind of way. Yeah. I don't really want to make enemies now. right now. I want to keep make, doing dumb stuff. Seven. Well, I mean, I can't stop you. You have pro green, so go. I do. <laughs> oh, yeah. I do. <laughs> yeah. I'm the Even only the green player. The problem is the, is the crackback. Mm -hmm. Oh, there will be crackback, yes. That's what I mean. I don't like that part. If you just sit and not hit me, I'll let you do the dumb stuff and not hit you next turn. I can handle a one turn deal. Yeah. Here you go. See? Alan, I think that means you and I are in trouble. Yeah, I'm a little worried. It's just seven. <laughs> I. You have a 12 12. I have a 13 13. <laughs> <laughs> so then you won't mind taking seven from Liberator. Um, I, I would, actually. Um, I don't have a choice, but I do okay. mind it. Okay, <laughs> that's fair. Mind it, you will. Yeah, Al. Blinky, solemn, get two more lands. Aren't you out of lands yet? <laughs> no! I put, like, 37 in here because I was so terrified of not being able to get what I needed. Because I don't know how to do anything. And it turns out I did all right. 11 commander damage from Olivia. That's fun. Ooh. That's nice. Mm. Great. Good for oh, me. Oh, good. Don't yeah. worry. I'm on six from the top. Uh, Where's our removal? <laughs> okay. So let's shuffle. Because what I was going to do, I realized I'm an idiot. I was going to Mystic Forge, but I can hit instead and then find out things. Okay. So somebody's going to take two. Alan, take two. Yep. I will draw a card. I did that one. I did that one. Okay, cool. Nothing has died. Sadness on the stack. No mimic vat. This is like the longest running solemn simulacrum in some time. Yeah. Putting him work. Buddy's just mm -hmm. hanging. Um, MVP. I like am going meta. to forge and look. Ooh. I don't need this. Uh, I'm going to tap the forge. I'm going to pay one life and exile planar atlas. Throw it in a garbage. Okay. I will call it here and pass. Let's untap. Now, your flyer is tapped, tapped, right, Olivia? Very much so. Very, very tapped? Yes. That's an interesting card. Unless. Um, unless what? Well, I mean, I still have five men. I can cast the top of my library <laughs> and I have this hand. And I have this hand. <laughs> <laughs> Let's tap Vohar to draw a card and discard a card. I'll discard this. Ancient Silver Dragon. Uh, hey! Oh. And, then I'll, and then I'll go to combat. I kind of want to get a bunch of stuff out of the creep. I kind of want. I, I kind of want to do that. And I'm going to hope this time that the Ancient Brass Dragon gets to do stuff. Olivia, I'm going to attack you in the air for seven with my Ancient Brass Dragon. I will flash in this Junk Diver and block. Oh, you're going to play a thing, are you? Yeah. Um, I really want to hit you. So okay. I'm going to pay three and say, you find the villain's lair and counter target spell. 
So I really want to get stuff out of the graveyard. Also, I kind of want your coveted jewel. <laughs> <laughs> I may or may not have ulterior motives here. I see. <laughs> so this means Olivia's the villain, right? Fingers crossed. Does it work? Let's see. I've got two mana remaining. That being said, I don't think I can do anything about it. So what I will do is flash out these lightning greaves and Junk Diver is countered. <laughs> that means Ancient Brass Dragon gets through unblocked. So oh. I untap and steal your coveted jewel. And I believe I draw three cards for that. Yeah, when it goes to someone yeah. else. So I draw three, I gain control of that, and I untap it. Oh, gross. I make a coveted jewel that will be that. We'll draw it in a little bit. But first, I have to deal the seven damage to Olivia and then roll the d20 again and hope that I get better numbers. It's going to be a one. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. The one. Zombies. Fifteen. No, I mean, me. Hey. Really? Why did you open your mouth? Huh? Getting big boys out here. You do realize that those can come for you too, right? I know. You only made a deal with dumb things happen. You only made a deal with me, you know. Oh, don't forget Gix. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, you yeah. got a gig figure, too. You oh, yeah, I'll pay a life and draw a card. Pay the life! <laughs> get there. <laughs> All right, so this is great. I've got a seven drop, an eight drop, and another eight drop, so I can get any two of these dragony, demony, wonderful thinginies. Um, oh, my God, I forgot to draw a card, too. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> and lose a life? Yeah. I, I think <laughs> I want the Overseer of the Damned and okay. the Astral Dragon. Nice. Did I pay a life and draw a card? I don't think I did. God damn it. Do it. Seeing as everyone's doing it, I want to do yeah, it too. Right? I'll lose a life and draw a card. <laughs> Overseer of the Damned, when it enters, I don't like that all of your stuff has trample. So, Ailey, I'm going to kill off your Kodama so that those things can't trample over my face, please. That face. It when dies. A non token creature and opponent controls dies. I get a tapped zombie token, but there's also a mimic vat and a. Uh, yeah, Olivia, do you sorry. want it? And Alan's got, uh, yeah? got the name of it. I do. No. <laughs> Harvester trigger, big red. Harvester, that's what it is. Uh, yep. I'll take it. Harvester trigger for sure. And then astral dragon. Here's the thing. Do I make two more coveted jewels? Oh, that's such a cool card. Yeah. When uh, astral dragon enters, I create two tokens that are copies of target non-creature permanent, except they're three three dragons in addition to their other types, and they fly. That's so that means cool. if somebody hits Why you, they get that? three coveted jewels. That's, they would get three coveted jewels, dragons. which seems risky, and it's probably not the right move, but I'm very <laughs> tempted to do that. I'm just saying I am the kind of person who would steal all of them back. <laughs> so I could get my own chromatic orrery, which is also very tempting. Sure, and you'd actually draw cards off of it, right? Yeah, you can do stuff with it. I can't. <laughs> I pay five and do nothing. <laughs> You gotta get two dragons. vexing puzzle boxes. That way they oh, see each other's dice rolls. Wait, what does it do? <laughs> I'm so confused. Oh, I, I'm, I'm intrigued this is by this. Such trash. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm genuinely. I'm, I'm curious. Well, what, you are rolling what, dice, so you and know. And they are doing cool unhinged. Oh stuff, yeah, and it'll so. see the it'll see the dragon. It'll dice see the, roll, yeah. the dice rolls from the dragon. They'll both too. see it. So whenever you roll one or more dice, put a number of charge counters on vexing puzzle box equal to the result. And if you have two of them, they'll see each other's die rolls and. You'll get there twice. Oh, as I'm, bad. I'm so into this. Astral Dragon is absolutely making two copies of the puzzle uh, box that are also I love three, it. three flyer dragons. <laughs> it's great. And they okay. tap for one. They tap for one and roll a d20. And also, you've got your your dragon that's rolling d20s and a second d20 dragon in the yard. So I yeah, I think oh. you can get there. I think By so too. Yeah. Speaking of him, I'll play a land for turn because mm -hmm. I because I drew some some cards and stuff. And then I'll pay two and I'll cast Persist and return target non-legendary creature card from my graveyard to the battlefield with a minus one counter on it. And let's get the Ancient Silver Dragon back now. Yeah. Seems good. Nice. Seems like a solid move. Nice. All right. You, friend, have a minus one on you. But I am absolutely so here good. for the Vexing Puzzle Box. Now, they do have Summoning Sickness, so I can't tap them here. But I do have the Coveted right. Jewel still. Oh, because they're creatures. Yeah, they're creatures. Yes. Yeah. Dragons, too. Yeah. But I do have the coveted jewel if I wanted to keep doing stuff that is silly, which is probably a thing I want to do at some point in my life. But I think I've just earned the attention of every single person, so maybe I should play it safe, actually. Uh, I'll start drawing my coveted jewel and I'll pass it to Alan. <laughs> We're going to draw a card and... Oh, nice. Land for turn. It's going to be Swamp. Yeah, I don't have any good attacks right now unfortunately which is real really a bummer gix is really not drawing me the cards drawing everybody else cards we're gonna tap 
three and roll the puzzle box. So we're gonna add a nice hearty, oh, hot 20 to that 11. Let's go. Hey. Um, love that. Good job. Uh, we're gonna extort a thought vessel. So everybody Word. lose one and I'll gain three. Extort a morbid opportunist. Oh, I love that card. It's a good one. What art is that on it? This is a, um, the who's he what's it foils. Oh, Double yeah. Feature. Double feature. That's what they're called, yes. That I looks love real these. nice. Yeah, they look gorgeous in person. This is a really the good The foils one. are cool from that. Everything else is like, really? Um, I love them. I've, I'll say this over and over again. They look gorgeous in real life. There is no cool way to show them off in pictures. Oh, I just mean like the execution of the product, not as much as like the art. Because I know that like a, a good foil will... It's, it's going to catch eyes no matter where yeah. it is. Oh, man. Now I want to do a monochrome deck, just black and white. Five. And it'll be a black nice. and white deck. That'd be awesome. Uh, we're going to play a Nightmare Shepherd, so I got a little more protection. Oh, dear. Guys. Nice. Uh, flying. Whenever a non-token creature I control dies, I may exile it. Token that's a copy of the creature, except it's a 1-1 one, one instead of all the cool stuff. That was extorted as well. Uh, so we've extorted three cards now, and we will wrap it up. Oh, we're going to so just fully... Alan's out here gaining a bunch of life. Mm. Yes, well, I got. Look at those board states. Everybody's got like lethal amount of damage out there. <laughs> like Thank it's, you, it's not tried. like I couldn't go down to like <laughs> the single digits on my turn. Uh, that's fair. <laughs> and we'll drop a an extorted typhoid rats as well. Uh, so that's death touch one one. That's it. No relevant uh, game advancing uh, moves. <laughs> <laughs> You're just like I'm gonna sit over just here. Gonna, I got one card in hand. And just scheme in mono black. <laughs> yep, do exactly what I was talking about and overextend, and I'll pass the turn. <laughs> oh, oh, that's fun. Okay, rules question because I I don't play these often. Morphs. <laughs> How did they work again? A uh, three so. mana face down as a two two creature, okay. and then at any time you can pay the cost that is printed there. It says morph and flip yeah. it face up. Okay. That is a special action that you can do at any time. Oh, do I want to do that. So Alan's back to starting life total. Yeah. And now old. has... Fine. Don't worry about it. I'm Think. worried, Alan. It's good. It's. Good. I'm just trying to... Can I live? Can I live? Big Brewster <laughs> boy. Joey. Joey. I'm Joey. Hi, Joey. Okay. I have a covered a jewel. Don't worry about it. But I can't get anything unblocked. It'll just get thrown under a... I don't know what you've got there. You have stuff. There's things and stuff. There's a 1313 still hanging out there. True. I have a 13-13, a 5-5, five, five, a 7-7, seven, seven, a 4-4, four, four, and two three threes. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. I'm concerned about Alan now. Olivia what? was scary, but you guys just kind of, you went in increasing levels of scary. I'm chilling. I just want to draw some cards. <laughs> Not even attacking anyone. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to like maintain. I'm you know, one card. If I can get back up to my starting hand size, then we'll start talking. All right. <laughs> See, my problem is I can't draw cards right now. I want them. Oh, because you ain't got the tramps no more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's extremely rude of you, Joey. Or, yeah, I don't it's have my Kadama. This you is, this is my card. Yeah. Think about that move. I should be <laughs> mad. At, I should be mad at Joey. <laughs> You know what? I am mad at Joey. I'm gonna oh, hit no. you. Oh, no. I'm gonna move to combat. <laughs> I am going to put four counters on my Gyre Sage, courtesy of Helena and Elena. We are gonna put another counter on you, my friend, because you saw another friend get a counter. Which one is Trample? You. Can't get through still, though. Crap. They're all tiny, comparatively. If I just swung all, I wouldn't kill you. That makes me mad. Hmm. Never mind. Second main phase. I'm going to pay, because why not? Wow. Uh, four, four life. I'm sorry. Who is this Ailey doppelganger? <laughs> I want to kill him in one go and I need trample, so I'm going to wait till I get that. Uh, I'm going to pay I, four life. I knew life. to be afraid of that Kodama. Yep. <laughs> you are right. This is eight. You better play some flying. Nine, ten, <laughs> eleven, twelve. Crack 13, on Joey right now. Fourteen. Fifteen. Four, what? That's you're counting too high. What are you doing? Fifteen for Hoodie Hydra. <laughs> Answers with fifteen one one counters on it. Yay. Fifteen? Fifteen. God damn. That guy or something. When this dies, I put a 1-1 one, one green snack token onto the battlefield for each 1-1 one, one counter on it. And it has morph, but yeah, but never mind. We figured that out. 
cast a green thing so everyone gets a counter. This will get several many more. I will work that out. But while I do that, you are good to go, Olivia. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, and oh you get boy. another 4-4. Four, four. I do. Thank you. <laughs> and then Olivia's like, how do I kill them all now? <laughs> uh, actually. Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Trumps for the bums for sure. I think it's within. Uh, no, it's not. No. Uh, <laughs> no, that Alan at 41 is a stumbling block, as it were. Nice. <laughs> so I have 25 mana right now. That seems good. And more than what Ailey has. Take three again from the crypt. All we gotta do is wait it out 10 turns, Aver an average of 10 turns. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and Olivia is going down. <laughs> There you go. Play a Basilisk Caller. Oh, good. I'm going to put it on Liberator. Now it's got flying pro four colors. Death Touch lifelink? Yep. I just want to stick around and have fun with my friends. Uh <laughs> <laughs> just play the All is Dust. It's fine. No. Hanger Backwalker <laughs> for 10, so five. Nice. So powerful. It's mainly the, this is not a CMC of 10. It's five, right? Because it's XX. You're still paying a total of 10. Oh, my so understanding is that its mana value is only 10 while it's on the stack. But once it's in play, I think it goes back when to... When you cast a spell. Yeah, you're still paying it's 10. when you cast a spell? In that yeah. case, yeah. Oh, yeah. okay, sick. Joey, how much damage do you have marked with... I have 11. Okay. Alan has three, but he's going to have 11 now because I'm swinging in with <laughs> the helicopter. Four. Huh? Was oh, you have four? four? Okay. It was four before, yeah. I think. It was four when it hit you. Yeah, that's yep. right. So I'm going to swing Jump. in with 11 or with eight from Battle Thopter. Yep. Okay. No blocks. All right. Great. I will do two damage to Alan's face. Nope. I will draw a card. Back down to 30. I will get two more basics. I don't think I'm going to be able to extort four times on my next turn. And you had <laughs> lifelink, so you gain 10. Is it 10? No, I dealt eight. Well, it, it the the What's oh two? does the sword deal oh, the damage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or does it deal the damage? The oh, sword, it, sword. It deals. it's the sword. It's the yeah. sword. Yeah. Yeah. So. Fine. Okay. So then, just eight. My kingdom for a good card on the top. Good God. I woke up and I got scared. Baby. Hello, got potato little, child. Got a little blobby <laughs> guy, huh? Oh, yeah. yes, potato. Oh, so sleepy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, Mystic. I'll look at the top. I'm at a life total that puts me back in the game. That's fun. I'll play a land for a turn. Yeah, I'll pass. Before it becomes my turn, you know me, my end step stuff. I'll tap the coveted jewel and I'll cast a thirst for meaning to draw three and discard two. We know nice. you're thirsty, Joey. It's okay. I'm so thirsty. Unless you discard a... An enchantment, but ah, I would right. rather toss this triplicate titan and this lord of the void into my graveyard. I think that's a nice place for them. Yeah. Yeah, uh, then I'll untap for turn. Let's tab Vohar, Vodalian Desecrator, to draw a card and discard a card. Uh, I will toss a Sphinx of Uthun into the graveyard. I don't, I you're not even talking English anymore. What? I know, right? It's just all these big <laughs> names, all these big guys. I want to hit people and people are scary. <laughs> um, and I have an Ancient Silver Dragon and that seems really good, but Ailey has reach. My, my creature's not that big. It's only five. It's got flying. Do you have only one flying, Alan? Yeah, I just got the Nightmare Shepherd. Okay. And Olivia could flash anything in, and I don't have more <laughs> chrono spells. So... Thank you for that extra information. <laughs> I guess I'll, I'll make... I'll give, I'll give Alan the hard choice. Alan, I'm attacking you with Ancient Silver Dragon and with Ancient Brass Dragon. Roll dice, roll dice. So you you choose whether I'm gonna draw a bunch of cards or whether I'm gonna get a bunch of stuff back from the graveyard. How much damage is each of them? We got seven on the brass dragon. How about the? the and this one boy? has a minus one counter, so it's also seven. They are both seven. Oh, no big deal. Um, we are going to. Jeez, I don't know what the right choice is here. I, think I don't they're either. Both, <laughs> they're both bad, honestly. And what's their toughness on both of them? They they're big, right? Six and seven. Yeah, nice. Okay. We'll push it in front of the blue one and we'll okay. uh we'll let the, the black one go through. Alright. So you take seven, and okay. then I roll a D twenty and try to get some stuff out of my graveyard again. A dead nightmare shepherd, I will get a Good harvester one. of souls trigger and a morbid mm -hmm. opportunist trigger. Yep. Nice. Uh, so I'll draw two. And 
18. Ooh. Ooh. That's a big res. You can take my Nightmare Shepherd if you want. <sighs> oh, I could. <gasps> oh, no, it's on damage, so it's not in there yet. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, I, yeah, I think that might be right. But I've got a 9, a 7, and another 7 here. And I kind of want both of these. This would be 16 total. So I'll get Lord of the Void and a Triplicate Titan. Nice. Lord of the Void oh. is a 7-7 seven, seven flying demon that steals stuff. And Triplicate Titan is a 9-9 nine, nine flying vigilance trample that blows up into a 3-3 three, three of each of those keywords if it dies. Oh, goodness. Love it. This is great. This is good for everyone who's having a great time. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> This is what the deck is doing the thing I wanted it to do. It also, sure wait, is. I rolled an 18, right? So the vexing puzzle box creatures. Yeah. Both get, 18. Creatures, yeah. Both get 18 counters. Bear, bear, yep. bear, 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 bear. That's rad. Oh, Alan is going to beat you to it. He's what are you going to do gonna about be, this? You're going to just have to stop playing vexing puzzle box. We will, <laughs> we will, <laughs> that's how it works. If somebody beats Someone you to 100, you, to it, it's you, out. You don't yeah. get to play it anymore. <laughs> I concede to Joey as Lord of the Puzzle Box. <laughs> Lord of the Puzzle Box. Alan All will right. be vexed. I want to try another weird one now. I'm going to pay five and I'll cast a very unusual reanimation spell, Incarnation Technique. Oh! Mill five cards, then return a creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield, but it also has Demonstrate, so I can make someone else do it and then I get to do it twice. So they don't Got have it. a say. I've used this in Conrad to force people to mill. It's really I dig it. And I'm wondering, I know that Ailey has a lot of like zero zero Hydra stuff, so that could be a good pick. Yeah. My Nightmare Shepherd. <laughs> and yeah, you definitely have something in your graveyard, so I'm hesitant to pick you. So Ailey, let's let's pick you. I might um, need mill five. You mill five, and then you may uh, return a creature from your graveyard to the battlefield, and then I'll do it twice. Relicrate Tower, Finhorn Elves. Oh, please don't only be Elves. Crag Crown Pathway. Mm -hmm. Rockfell Vale, oh god, and Scale the Heights, son of a Ooh, dingleberry. You, you get an elf. <laughs> you get a Fendorn elf. Well, schnitzel. That's powerful magic. Alrighty. Uh, then I'll do mine. So, Victimize, Lord of Change, that's a 6-6 six, six that draws cards. Signet, Island, Thirst for Knowledge. Um, so then I'll return, do I want Sphinx of Athun? I don't think I do. I think I want the Lord of Change. <laughs> so I'll return the Lord of Change. It enters, I draw three cards, and then I'll resolve the other copy of the Incarnation Technique on the stack. I would have preferred to mill those cards. And now I'll mill five more in return. So Port okay. of Carfell, Phyrexian Metamorph. Oh, good. That, Tomb Fortress, Phyrexian Tower, and Charter Course. I'll get the Metamorph. And the Metamorph will copy the Triplicate Titan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so much stuff. Triplicate this is so gross. Titan. This is wonderful. I love this. Mm. I think I have to move to the end of my turn. Now, correct me, the blue one was blocked, so I didn't get that trigger this turn, which means I still have seven as my max hand size. Don't you always nice. have seven of your max hand size? If this had hit, it would have eliminated my hand size. But yeah. I want to make sure I do have a hand size so that oh. I can start discarding more creatures into my graveyard. Ah. I played right into your, I played right into your uh, <laughs> hand. Yeah, nice. Yep. Got that. <laughs> I'll discard Nezahal and an Archfiend of Despair and a Mana Rock, and I will pass <laughs> the turn. Amazing. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. We've played uh, no lands yet. We're going to tap for three. We'll leave the Thought Vessel up. So two, three, four. Five six. We will extort an Alhamaret's archive. Oh, oh no! Oh, well, I know what that one does. So someone wants again anyway. Double the cards. <laughs> we're trying to. We're, bit, we're playing greedy. Um, it, we get a roll for the vexing puzzle box. <laughs> yep. That's we're gonna get extorted to death. So we are at forty three, which feels good. Getting close. It's a and dice race. Now I will move to punchies and we'll swing at Olivia with the typhoid. It's one one death touch on the ground. Coming at you. I mean, I could draw some cards. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 13. No, don't. That's, I... Don't count all your mana. Why? <laughs> I just want to know what I have. I'm going to tap two. I'm going to play this Arcane Signet off the top. Solid. Thank you, Mystic Forge. I will look at what's next. It is of no consequence. This is on oh. Declare Attacks. Yes. Just one, hey? One. One Death Touch. Do I want to get five Thopters? It's a good, it's a good question. Could make a little I, wide army. I know I could. Lock some dragons. I mean, the only thing I don't have anything buff on them right now, so they'd just be little little dinkaroos. I will just take one. Alright, solid. I will pay one life and I will draw two cards. In response. I'm gonna look at this again. Oh <laughs> we're gonna pay 
another six and we'll play a flyer uh it's not much but it's on its work right uh the, whatever the meme is uh it is an indulgent <laughs> tormentor flying five ah. three at the beginning of your upkeep draw a card unless target opponent sacrifices a creature or pays three life um cool. i will extort this guy also ding 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 everybody takes one i gained six now yeah yep and oh, oh, not super archive. thrilled about that no that's, that's a lot very good I will. I'm out of out of castable stuff unless I yeah I paid all my mana to do stuff. I'm gonna ship it from there. all of my crap I will draw. Oh no. <laughs> Good rhymes. Uh, so if I I need to. <laughs> yes. Joey, how many creatures do you have? That's a great question. I'm One, so two, happy three, you four, asked. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen total creatures, but three of them are currently tapped, so I have ten eligible blockers. Ten blockers, uh-huh. I, I tried to say blockers and bachelors at the same time for some reason. I have ten eligible bachelors over here on my <laughs> Tamage target. Don't worry. <laughs> ten, okay. Tamage target. <laughs> Joey. Hot dog fingers, yeah. Could I <laughs> <laughs> Could I have that jewel to try and find something to deal with Alan? If you sent like the elf over here, I won't block the elf. But I want to turn things sideways. I do want to turn things sideways. <laughs> yeah, well, turning the elf sideways. How many death touches do you have up now, Alan? One death toucher up. Only one? Just one. I want to do more damage, man. <laughs> but the, hitting you doesn't do anything for me. I get a card if I hit. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Yes. Joey. Embrace your greed. Yeah, yeah. I, need to, I can swing things at you, but then stuff just dies and you get like five million cards off of it. That's screwed. Big green things go sideways. Uh, oh, I will no. move to combat. I am putting five counters on our Defiler of Vigor. So now you are at eight and then you get one more and then you don't get anything now. It's just that. Didn't miss anything else. It's gonna be brutal. That's a way cool deck. Helena and Elena are awesome. Yeah, they're sweet. Right. Helena and Elena are getting in there because they have first strike. The filer of vigor. This is all coming at you, Alan. Good. And this. Believe guy... the life gain drew a little bit of a target on your back, sir. Yes. <laughs> My cute little tokens are coming at you as well. It's a lot of boys. Hmm. Defiler is the one that's got the trample. Yeah, that's the only trampler. Hmm. So first strike, trample, enormous, kind of big, not so big, maybe. And you know what, Joey, can I have that covered to jewel anyway, just to draw some cards? I'll allow it. Thank wow. you. Ben Hornell's a Joey. Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh, and then that, wait, I have to deal damage with Gix's this thing, right? Yes. Yeah. We will push, okay. um, I hate it, the harvester in front of your 15-15. Okay. And this makes very many babies for me when it dies. Oh, Just... it does? Is that what that yeah. one does? Oh. It makes mm. 15 baby snakes. Oh, that's maybe less than good then. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Especially yeah. if Joey gives me cards to then put stuff on. Then I would uh, uh, maybe not kill that. <laughs> how, much total, yo how much total is coming at me? That's uh, 34. Oh, it's way more than lethal. That's uh, <laughs> 40. Yes. <laughs> A lot. Oh, my God. 54. Nice, solid. Um, <laughs> we will put the uh, Harvester of Souls in front of the big snake guy. Uh, um, we will put the uh, Tormentor in front of the 6-6 six, six and the 6-6 the six, six token. And I will push the Opportunist in front of the 5-5 five, five there. Is there two of them? Yeah, there's two 5-5s. Five so in front of one of those. And then okay. we've got nine plus another five, 14. And how big is the defiler? It's 14. It's 14? Yeah. So it's still, nah, leaves me at four. Sure. <laughs> You're going to draw a bunch of cards. Harvester triggers. I will draw none of your stuff. Oh, one of your stuff dies too. Sick. Yeah, because you put the death touch in front of the hooded hydra, right? Yep. Okay, so, so I have 15 snakes now. I do not want a hooded hydra. Morbid opportunist trigger is two cards the harvester of souls sees three other creatures die so i draw eight cards oh because of the archive nice yeah hey remember how you wanted to get back to your starting hand 
We got there. <laughs> Two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'm realizing, so four total creatures died, or was it five? It's uh, five total creatures died. Uh, whenever a non-token creature an opponent controls dies, I create a tapped two to block the zombie creature token. Nice. Nice. Were any of those tokens that died, or were they all? Nope. No, they're yeah. all real, real boys. I'll make a bunch more zombies. So the other ones you blocked didn't die, hey, Alan? The 5-5 five, five and the... Uh, none of the, the tokens six, died, no. Okay, cool. All right. I got 15 snack friends. It's very poorly drawn snack, but it's okay. And then I get the covets of jewel from you, Joey. Yes, you did. <gasps> it See, you look it. I introduced, I introduced something that let other people do stuff and have fun. Yes, I'll also pay one life to draw from Gix. Oh, yeah, because you hit me. Yep. I did. <laughs> Hope I don't regret this decision. <laughs> Uh, I mean, sure, why not? Another forest. With one forest, I will play a soul ring. <laughs> and then, sure, why not? This is gonna get messy. Uh, for an incubation druid, and I will put a counter on all my things. Oh, including wow. Including my 15 snacks. Oh, that's a lot of snacks. <laughs> oh my god, the Wildwood Scourge is going to be enormous. Uh-huh. Oh, this is, oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I need to math this now, so I'm gonna oh, do that. <laughs> But that's my turn. Don't worry about the math. On your end step. Oh. Oh. Okay. You guys can oh. all sacrifice all your colored permanents. There it is. Ah! There's the olive dust. And like an absolute animal, you waited for my harvester of souls to go. You bastard. <laughs> <laughs> if it has a color, it goes away. That's all you need to know. You sacrifice it at least. Will my overseer of the damned see all of that? Yep. Mm-hmm. Cool. Can you count the Wait. number of non-token creatures that die for me, please? And what is Overseer doing for you? I'll create tapped zombies. Okay. So they won't be able to block whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all. You should down the pike, I'm sure. One, two, yeah. three, four, five, six, All right, so seven. you first. Got yeah. it. Seven. Alan, any from you? Two. Two? Okay, so... and Not nothing all you guys, guys, right? So yeah. I would get nothing nine zombies left over. <laughs> oh, no, the rats. Three. Ten zombies left over. And then the other four, I will play Crypt Thrall, so all artifact creatures I control have hexproof. <laughs> um, I'm going to respond to that. I need to respond to that. Response? Um, I, I have a lot of creatures in my graveyard now. <laughs> I'll pay one and cast Overwhelming Remorse because your Urza Battle Thop Thop does not have protection from black. Oh, no, it doesn't. What does that do? Gotta... Exile target creature or planeswalker. And I'm afraid oh, okay, of all so... the drawing that you could do. So put it in the command zone. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I think that might be necessary of me. Okay. You good? You're done responding? Uh, Yeah, that's me. Okay. I have 10 tapped Zombos and Triplicate Titan Ancient Stone Idol is still here. Hi, buddy. Hey, I don't take damage this time. I will drop her turn. I will look at the top card as Mystic Forge allows me. All right, I will tap five with Chromatic Orrery to play Urza's Battle Flapter. Yay. <laughs> I will attach all the things. Dig it, dig it, dig it, dig it. You didn't do the dig it, dig it, dig game loss. Be more oh, careful oh, next oh, time. Oh, oh. I will then put Lightning Greaves on it. Uh-oh. Uh, it's fine, Joey, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> I'm afraid. <laughs> Should I have be. 11 damage from that thing. You, yeah. Um, <laughs> but look at the, look at the right side. I don't think I can take you out because it's two, four, I six, do have seven blinders. right now. Okay. Uh, flying Vigilance Trample. These guys do help out a lot right now, actually. Um, what's on top? I will tap two to play a treasure map. Hey, here we go. Yes, let's see. <laughs> that's such an uh, evil Corella DeVille voice. Mm. Like, that's just, mm, yes, <laughs> yeah. let's see. That was just straight up Maleficent voice right there. Ailey, you've got my jewel, hey? I sure do. Hey, you won't for long. Um, <laughs> I won't it. You're precious. Precious. I'll tap six for a scavenged brawler. Flying Vigilance Trample Lifelink. Mm -hmm. uh, I can pay five exile from a yard, choose a creature. It gets four one one counters, a flying counter, a vigilance counter, a trample counter, and a lifelink counter on it. That's a lot of counters. Sure. Yeah. Colorless. Great. Are we all about to die? No, I don't <laughs> think so. I don't think I can capitalize totally. I will pay for Karn Living Legacy. The plus ones, I create a tapped Power Stone token. Minus one is any amount of mana. 
minus seven is any time I tap an artifact, uh, emblem deals one damage. I will pay four to play Traxos, Scourge of oh. <laughs> Gee, I wonder if you can untap it. No, of course I can. I'll pay two for <laughs> Tiller Engine. Uh-huh. Hey, look, he, he untapped. Hey, <laughs> ta-da. I would very much like to play this. Hmm. Don't worry. Don't worry, she says. It's fine, How, much, how many flying blockers, Joey? Two. Ailey, I gotta attack you, honey. <laughs> it's fine. You like shiny things, I know. I need my, I need the jewel. Wait, what do you think? It's just uh, <laughs> Liberator. How, how big is he? Five. I'll gain five. I'll deal two damage to Joey's face. Makes sense. <laughs> I will blink simulacrum. Get two lands, draw a card, and then I'll draw three cards from Coveted Jewel. And then Tiller Engine, whenever a land enters the battlefield tapped and under my control, I can choose one to untap the land or tap target non-land permanent and opponent controls. Mm -hmm. I will untap the lands. That's way cool. I thought that was gonna be a useless card and here I am. Did you activate Karn yet or no? No, I have not. I'll play an Ash Barons. So I've got, yikes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm very much at this spot where it's like, I can't actually capitalize and someone could just, like, I am not saying I'm not scary, but there's a very tenuous that space I'm in. That precipice before the moment. Yeah, oh. right? Yeah. Alan saved your butt by killing my 15-15, just Absol saying. Absolutely. <laughs> so you should kill him last. Look at me politicking for you, Alan. Appreciate it. I'm, I'm nice. I see you. <laughs> I see you. Okay, I will... Oh my God, like my heart is just pounding out of my chest. <laughs> <laughs> nice. that means you're having a good turn. I know, I know. My like, my you can't stop the thought. My little heart monitor on the watch is just like, hey, is everything okay? It's like, no, yeah. it's not. I play the Ash Barons. I got those two wastes. Thank you, Tiller Engine. That was clutch. I will tap the coveted jewel. I'll play a Forsaken Monument. Oh, oof. 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 everyone's making so much noise when I do stuff. That's a lot. Uh, good. Yeah. Good. Lots happening. Oh, that's so gross. You have so much mana now. <laughs> well, no, I mean, I will next turn if I survive. <laughs> hey, Joey. Hey, I'm Joey. <laughs> you gonna kill Olivia somehow? No, I haven't done <laughs> I've done a lot, but... <laughs> um, I mean, I do have some flyers. Why? <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. Wait, what is the thing you do when they get to 100 counters you get like, to find an artifact and put it on the battlefield ah. yep. three artifacts and you don't even sacrifice them they it sticks around yeah I, that's cool i'm really excited for that and on the end step i will be tapping these to roll the dice um yeah please do but i don't think i have any other artifacts in this deck for them to find uh, okay <laughs> i think i got to... them, them out already like, I think hey, one. Whole thing. <laughs> if you if you proc that and fail to find then i think i, I failed to stop find. maybe the greatest thing ever all right i'm gonna tap my final wastes i'm gonna use one and tap treasure map to scry i already know what's on top i'm gonna put it on the bottom mm -hmm. I swear to God, there's only one card i need right now this is not it i have one remaining <sighs> get a landmark counter don't I forget i do thank you i will make a tapped power stone token oh i'll just use my dave matthews guitar pick here yep. <laughs> it's as good as power for as, for as far as i'm concerned casual brag i caught it fair and square i elbowed my <laughs> way up to the front and no one could stop me <laughs> i wouldn't stop you if i saw you coming i'd be like nope you, you got it all yours well, see, well remember the problem is, is that everybody else at the show is trying to do the same thing i just happen to be short so i can mm. like really easily <laughs> navigate feisty. the spaces between people <laughs> You, you go for their knees because they're all top heavy. The space I don't even have to. Oh my god! I don't even have to do that. Like when you elbow your way to the front, every mm. elbow is a kidney or a liver, liver shot. So everybody's doubling over. I usually don't even have to use them. Like people like turn to talk to the people next to me. I just slip in between them. Just like hey! <laughs> left a trail of doubled over people. No, I don't. That's mean. I only do it to people that start yelling woo in my ear and it's like, oh my God, I stumbled. I'm so sorry. Shut the f up. Okay. Amazing. I... I'll just yeah. have this visual that I'm like an aerial shut up. People are like, <laughs> flying. Just parting behind so this little good. tiny like figure just like wheedling through. All right, I, <laughs> we've got her. I'm gonna pass 
and be terrified for my life. <laughs> On the end step, I'm gonna nice. tap both of these. Get to, there. To Double twenties. 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 The first on. one. Twenties. Is a fourteen. That's not oh, bad. So not thirty-two. Not bad. And the second one is a fourteen. Wow. Eight. 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 Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Judge. So, I know, right? <laughs> you add 28 to both of them? That's yeah. fire. So 46, <laughs> right? Then we untap for the turn. So Olivia, Disrespect. what is your flyer Real situation? My flyer situation is one. Tenuous at best. <laughs> you have one flyer. I'm going to move to the flunge step. <laughs> um, there's much I've, flunging. There's much flunging. <laughs> I'm going to send two zombies at Alan, three zombies at Ailey. Well, he's mm -hmm. going for it. You're trying to kill us? Yeah. What? Um, kinda... No, you gotta swing for it, Ailey. And then five. Yeah, I know. Uh, <laughs> oh. He's got tricksies. And then five. The rest are gonna attack Olivia. Two, three, three flying puzzle box creatures. Don't worry about them. <laughs> I'm <laughs> a 13 13 with trample and then two 9 9 flying Vigi trample. Big colorless triplicate titan folks. Well, shall we go around the table, Alan? How would you like to block? These are yours. I'm dead. I get smashed. Killed by two zombies. I got nothing. Oh, did I cast something after Forsaken Monument? I did. You did, yeah. Oh, you gain life, yeah. From I the... gain life. I get two life from that. I cast one thing. Mm. I got no bros. I am. Right. I have F all. So that would take you down to two. Yes. Sorry, right, Alan. Nah, you're good. You're good. You're good. I was gonna do awful stuff on my turn. You're <laughs> super glad. You're super glad you did this. Okay. <laughs> extremely glad. So what's the total damage coming at me? So twenty nine plus eighteen, so forty seven. So it's thirty one trampoline damage that is making its way <laughs> downtown. Walking fast. Making my way downtown. Yeah. Walk. <laughs> Thank you, really, for picking up. What <laughs> All your artifact friends are plus two plus two now as well, right? Yeah, they're yep. big. You left. She's like, I'm not dealing with this fight. Yeah. <laughs> In the swamp I go. If she's able to kill the Thopter Maker, that could really futz things up. Oh yeah, because then you've got three threes instead of little one ones. Mm -hmm. You know, flash in a KCI real quick. I can only block six, so you have exactsies on the flying trample alone. Cool. I can't kill this first, so yeah, I'm out. Is that life included? Because you got lifelink on something, right? Oh. Oh. Gotcha. How big is that? 6-6. Six, six. With its buff or not? With the buff, yeah. With the buff. So it's 6 or 31, effectively. So if that's 31 tramplies, and then the other three threes would get around that, whatever. Yeah, because then I still only have four blockers after that, and they can't do any air support. So, no, he got me. Awesome. Yep. Yay. Good job. Good job, Titans. I appreciate it. Uh, second main, I'm going to pay four and I'm going to cast Diabolic Servitude. When it <laughs> enters the battlefield, I return target creature card from my graveyard to the battlefield. Yes. I'm going to pick this Archfiend of Despair that I discarded ages ago. At the beginning of each end step, each opponent loses life equal to the life they lost this turn. Ah, okay. Is that a single target spell by any chance? Uh, it's an enchantment, and then it has an ETB trigger to return target creature from my graveyard to the battlefield. I would like to bolt bend that. Change the target of target spell or ability with a single target. So huh. what else you got in there, Joey? I, huh, I am not pleased about this. <laughs> I have a Lord of Change, Lord of the Void, Ancient Brass Dragon, Overseer Destroys a Thing, Ancient Silver Dragon, Astral Dragon, and a Nezi. Uh, oh, and a Sphinx of Uthun, which is a fact of fiction. Ah. Uh. What sucks the least for me? <laughs> the one that destroys stuff, you could use it to destroy like his stuff. Well, well I she's just picking me to just get a different, the different target. Oh, yeah. so you yeah. pick the target. Oh, that's yeah. less. Yeah. yeah, and this is a May, so it wouldn't force me to destroy anything. Yeah, but it's a just... five five, which is weaker than all the others. Sure, get a five five. Sounds all good. All right, I'm alive. Let's see cool. what I can do with. Get not it. Get it. Oh, uh, sorry. Wait, are you untapping? Um, I would like to. Oh. Oh, well, I, but I have another play on my second main phase. Um, ah. I'll cast Dance of the Dead. Yes, mother. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'll bring that one back again. Fine, yeah. Joseph. <laughs> hey, Joey, you only won because of me. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, Wait a second. I got more where this came from. <laughs> 
I'm not surprised. I put surprised. the romance in necromancy. <laughs> Once again, you only had that yard because of me. It's a this beautiful is yard. True. You're welcome. <laughs> it was a good yard. <laughs> I wish, I wish uh, there was a bajuka bug from Alan, but alas. Mm. Yeah, big <laughs> move. No, no bugs out here. I got, I'm all in on card draw and life gain on this one. Just trying to draw cards. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just good trying game. to do stuff. Oh, that was too good. good. That was a good game for sure. What a game. GG's. It was going so well that you made us all sacrifice things. Listen, I... Well, it was going well for me. Uh, just, it was going well for everybody, and then Joey... I forgot about the, getting all the zombies. <laughs> It's yeah, fine. that's uh that kind of threw a spanner yeah. in the works there for you. But I I'm really happy with the deck for a first outing and having finished it about 15 minutes before we started the game. Yep. So yeah, yep. can't cannot complain about the uh <laughs> <laughs> Your Thopter can't stop the thop. That thing just went off. That was uh, It was so much fun! Oh bravo, goodness, colorless! Bravo. Oh my have you have you discovered a new love? Is Bray going to get I mean, put aside while you play with no. your colorless friends? <laughs> no. God, no. I love the uh, ridiculous artifact stuff, but yeah, I was I was kind of scared actually about like not being able to like ramp into it, and I was really worried. I was like, I'm never going to get to where I need to like cast big stuff. I, it's fine. <laughs> You're great. Yeah, no problem. Also, please do the following things, dear viewers at home. You know, the dread bargain. Mm. Click the things that make the dings. <laughs> Yeah. Join our Patreon. We've got some amazing altar sleeves coming from Damarai Neuromancer, one of their most incredible artists. We're so excited to have worked with her for those. We will have more details on that coming up. Soon. And yes. then, yes, very soon. And yeah, check out our amazing sponsors. Use links, our codes, use the links. It's all down below. Yeah. Like, subscribe, share, do stuff. You know, algorithm. Mm hmm. That's <laughs> <Pease it>. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me how I missed triggers the last time, because I'm sure at some point there was a spell I cast that was more powerful than the thought. So if you yeah. play a magic game without missing a trigger, then you should just stop playing because you've achieved everything and you could. You've hundred percent. If you, play, if you it. play a commander game without missing a trigger, go play an RCQ. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah, what are you watching this for? <laughs> <laughs> but we thank you for watching, and we'll yeah, see no, you guys great. next week. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>